Feeling blue without you Give me one more chance Give me one more dance Feel Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to go over something kind of semi-regular this month with me just because I happen to be buying a whole bunch of them. I actually went and bought another of the Ipsy mystery boxes that are available from previous months. Um, you can buy them for $30. Normally they're $25. This is the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus and this one happens to be for August of 2019. Um, both July and August of last year was really weird. They didn't put any bags or anything in the boxes with them. So who knows what's going to happen, but let's take a look. The first thing that I see in here is something I actually saw in a, a bunch of the different videos that I watched because I go to YouTube obviously and I watch the other unboxings and stuff of these. This is by Pixie. It is their Glow Mist. It says with Aragon Oil and Propolis, whatever that is. It's a nourishing mist. Um, if you look really closely in there you can see the oil at the top of this. So I think I'll probably save this and use it during winter time when my skin tends to get a little more dry. Otherwise, most of the time my skin tends to get a little too oily during the summer, which is what it is right now. So cute, gonna keep it, gonna use it. Next in here is by one of everybody's favorite brands. They see an Ipsy all the time, Wander Beauty. This is the Catch the Light Highlighter and Glowation in the color Catch the Light. It's got a cute little, cute little head on this. Let's see. So it looks like it's a glow stick to rub on your face. And then if I twist this, the extra stuff is in the bottom. So it is a two for one product and that's really cool. However, I'm really weird about highlighters. I don't like liquid highlighters. I don't like stick highlighters. I need a powder highlighter. It has to be dry. Otherwise I won't use it just because of how oily my skin is. So though this is really pretty and really cute, this is actually not for me. So that will be going to someone else. Next in here, ooh. I've gotten a product by them before. This is Thrive Cosmetics. This is their Liquid Lash Extension Mascara. Okay. Okay. See what it promises there on the back? It promises you to use some very thick lashes. My problem is, is I don't like it if it clumps. But that's really pretty. Really cute. Love the packaging. It's in the color Rich Black also known as Bryn. Oh, dude, that's some that's some high class packaging right there. That not only is that pretty and that's metal. Ooh, that's metal. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Ooh, and this is the type of brush that I really like too. Oh. I was gonna give this up because I have so many other mascaras already, but I think I'm gonna have to keep this. This is one fancy ass bitch eyeliner. Ooh, I like that. Yes, Thrive Cosmetics, you go for it. Ooh, okay. Another brand that I love, that's from Ipsy. It's Pure Lease. Everybody loves Pure Lease, um, or at least most of us do anyway, I'm assuming. They tend to be a little on the expensive side if you're buying stuff individually from them. And uh, so I recommend just trying and picking up a couple extra boxes to see if maybe you can get something from them in it. This is their Watermelon Energizing Aqua Balm Life Free, or Life Free, Lightweight Oil Free um, Gel Cream Moisturizing. And it says it's 
for oily combination skin and it works great for sensitive skin free of parabens minerals sulfates and as always animal cruelty free so, okay let's see how big you are i keep getting a lot of pure lease products in these random boxes that i buy it i absolutely love that like I got the blue lotus cream before. I'm gonna open this since I'm keeping it. Yep. Oh, yeah. That smells amazing. So, you would think fresh, real watermelon smell. Oh no, this smells like watermelon sour patch kids or like watermelon Jolly Ranchers. Oh, it is. Mm, it's beautiful. Oh, yes. Okay. Definitely a keeper for me. And last but not least in here is this cute little eyeshadow palette by Huda Beauty. This is the Smoke Obsessions. Let's go ahead and open this. Oh. <laughs> well, I might not be using this. It's, I don't want to tilt it too much because it might fall out, but it's, shattered. There's one, two, three, four, five, six. Six of nine pants in here are shattered. So, um, I'm gonna close that back up. That means I'm gonna have to email Ipsy and let them know and see what's gonna happen. Um, last time I had an eyeshadow product arrived broken and shattered all they did was refund me like five bucks instead of sending me a new item and personally in my opinion they should have sent me a new one but whatever whatever but honestly keep a four out of five items this is the only thing that's not for me and it's really just personal preference because i don't like liquid highlighter stuff but you know what for thirty dollars that's a damn good box and honestly that brings a total of like six dollars an item which is pretty spot on for me so yes all right well that's gonna be it for this unboxing i will see you guys for the next one don't forget to stop by and see us again bye guys feeling blue without you Give me one more chance, give me one more dance. Yeah.